Hi, let's see how to write programs on arithmetic instruction set in assembly language. So already you know that uh, there are some predefined instructions in your assembly language to perform your all arithmetic operations. Like so, these arithmetic operations are addition, subtraction, multiplication, division and increment decrement so by using this instruction set we will do some programs in keel ok so and how to test results so all those things you will see one by one so this is the final instruction set for your in your assembly language addition between a and address a and rr a and constant value a with pointer register value and add c with carry and decimal adjust, decrement, division, increment, multiplication and subtraction. So these are the possible operations in arithmetic instruction set. Then, so I will write some programs based on this. <coughs> I am looking to add two 8 bit numbers and I just want to save my result with a specified location. The two in RAM memory. So for that you need to create project in keel. So just double click on keel microvision and choose project tab and select the option new project. And here so try to select your destination folder uh, which is so whatever you are looking. Now my project name is arithmetic. and click on save and here this is the device you have to choose for which microcontroller you are going to write the program and just click on atmel target device which is my manufacturer name and select plus mark it will show the list of devices from this manufacturer and choose the microcontroller from this atmel manufacturer and click on ok and this is a startup code file warning just click on no so this is the procedure to create project for your microcontroller now so go file tab and just click on new tab so this is the editor you have to write your instructions now I just want add two numbers and save the result in RAM and before typing program try to save this file for that go file tab and choose the option save now this is my file name is addition so here dot asm extension is must ensure so you have to give dot asm extension and click on save and now so try to give uh, try to use two registers to perform this addition operation and I am giving two values which is 45H and the other register value which is 86H so these are the two random numbers I am going to add and just use add instruction to perform addition operation between A and B so these are the two instructions so this is the instruction to perform your addition operation after addition operation the result with accumulator now I am moving this result into 20H address location the two RAM memory location and end so this is the program to add two 8 bit numbers and second number with B. This is a program to add two 8 bit numbers and you can save your results in memory location 20H. To compile this program choose target 1 from project workspace window and click on plus mark and you will get source group 1. Just select it and right click and select the option add files to source group 1 and give your program name 
and how to select that you can choose file of type is asm and you can select your file addition and choose add button and then close once you add the file you will get plus mark with the source group one now go project tab and choose the option build target so it will show the errors and warnings with the program if anything wrong with the syntax then it will show the error in a specific line now so i just want to check the output whether the two numbers addition result which is saved in 20h or not for that select debug tab and choose the option starter stop debug session and this is a memory window which is available from view tab view and you can click on memory window you will get this so within this memory window you can type your address like which address location you are looking to test and for ram memory type d and followed by colon and followed by address 20h now so by default there is no value in 20h memory location but by executing this program step by step to execute this program step by step use f11 function key from keyboard so by executing first line i got 45 into a and 86 with b register by adding 85 86 and 45 the result is cb this is hexadecimal value so this cb value i am expecting in 20h memory location so i got this cb 8 bit result in 20h ram memory location and you want to test which flag is affected so coming to whenever you are doing addition operation between two numbers so all flags will affect based on result now i don't have any carry and i don't have any auxiliary carry and overflow no overflow and parity so why i got this parity as one because in cb so cb means 1100 1011 so i have five ones five is a odd number so because of odd number result in your result if you have odd number of ones your parity becomes one in your result you have even number of ones your parity remains zero so this is the way you can test output for your addition program so you are looking to stop debug session go debug tab and stop the debug session thanks for watching